from a point P on the ground, the angle of elevation of the top of a tower is 30 degrees and that of the top of a flagstaff fixed on the top of a tower is 60 degrees. If the length of the flagstaff is 5 meters, find the height of the tower. So here, from a point on the ground, from a point P on the ground, the angle of elevation of the tower, here A, B is a tower, the angle of elevation of the tower is 30 degrees, is 30 degrees. From the same point, the angle of elevation of the flagstaff which is fixed on the top of a tower. So here, we have a flagstaff BC. BC is a flagstaff. The angle of elevation of the flagstaff is 60 degrees. This total is 60 degrees. Now, here, this angle is 60 degrees. And flagstaff is 5 meters high. This is 5 meters high. We need to find the height of the tower, this one. So, I will consider the base as like x meters. So, we need to find AB. So, total will be here like h plus 5. h plus 5. So, first I will take the right angle triangle PAB. Triangle PAB. Then I will take triangle PAC. In triangle PAB, tan theta is opposite by adjacent. Here, tan 30, opposite is H, adjacent is X. So, tan 30 is 1 by root 3 is H by X. So, X equals H root 3. Now, if you take the triangle PAC, in this the angle is 60 degrees but opposite will be like h plus 5 now h plus 5 by x adjacent is x so tan 60 is root 3 h plus 5 by x so root 3 x equals h plus 5 now from here the value of x this value i'll substitute over here so root 3 into h root 3 equals h plus 5 root 3 into h root 3 is 3h equals h plus 5 3h minus h equals 5 2h equals 5 so h equals 5 by 2 so h is nothing but 2.5 meters so the tower is 2.5 meters high